One family in Lockport has learned to communicate through the language of love. With three biological children and three adopted children, it is certainly a full house. Like for someone else, it probably feels like a lot and crazy, and, but uh, for us, it's just kind of life. It's pretty normal. Seven Eyewitness News reporter Twila Nugent brings us this Seven Eyewitness News Extra on Lockport's Modern Family. Who's got a man set or glad? From the outside, just your average family dinner. But take a look inside and you'll see six faces. They may not look alike, but they're all family. Three brothers, three sisters. I think for us, at some point, we stopped asking, like, why would we? And then just started asking, why wouldn't we? Because we knew there were <laughs> kids that needed a home and we felt like we had the space and we had the love in our hearts and so why not? Why not add three adopted children to the three that Megan Foster calls her homegrown children. The Foster's latest adoption has spread across social media like wildfire. The Lockport family brought home another child from China just this past summer. 11 year old Fen completing the circle around the very full dinner table. Fen, we now officially have eight people in our family, which means everyone gets to draft one baseball team. There's Michael and Megan's homegrown children, Clay, Karis, and Michaela, Matthias and Abraham from Ethiopia, and Fen from China. Each of the kids are so different. Even our three homegrown ones are so different from each other. Getting to know them as a person and their personality and what they like and what they don't like and, you know, just their quirks. and It's just so fun. Sometimes it's challenging. But to endure the challenges of parenting six kids, Michael and Megan, guided by their faith, offer this little bit of advice. Love, <laughs> faith, hope, and love. Forgiveness. Grace. Grace. Definitely grace. A blended family that probably is a lot like your own. It's probably not that different than, I don't know, what a lot of normal families yeah. experience. The yeah. no. Kids that obey, kids that don't, kids yeah. that tip their applesauce yeah. over Able? and eat out of their bowl. Is that normal? Okay. Though the family is working through language barriers with Fen. I sometimes feel like we're peeling back the layers of an onion and just learning more and more about her all the time. And you know, it, it's fun. It's sometimes mentally kind of daunting. The Foster family is learning there's a common language they all share. We talk about speaking in love and just mm -hmm. that love communicates beyond language and beyond language barrier and that just every culture can understand, mm -hmm. receive and give love and so we, we try to focus on that as much as we can. Each season of parenting for us has been filled with unique challenges and unique joys at each season so we just embrace the chaos and uh, <laughs> and have fun and don't try to control it all. And you know we control what we can control, we trust God with the rest. In Lockport, Twila Nugent, 7 Eyewitness News.